Hi, in this video, I'm going to talk about targeted therapy. What is it? Who gets it? What to expect when you get it? Side effects you might experience, how you'll be followed, and I'll touch a little bit on costs as well. What is targeted therapy? Targeted therapy is a broad term that refers to treatment that specifically target a specific molecule on the cancer cells. If your tumor has the HER2 protein or is found to have extra copies or overamplification of the gene, you will be offered targeted therapy. This is regardless of the stage of your cancer if your cancer is invasive. We do not give targeted therapy for ductal carcinoma in situ, also called stage zero. If your tumor is HER2 positive and you have stages one to three breast cancer, targeted therapy will be given along with chemotherapy. If you have advanced breast cancer, stage four or metastatic cancer, where the cancer has spread to other parts of your body and we can see that spread on scans or on an X-ray, or in your blood work, chemotherapy along with targeted therapy is one option. You can get targeted therapy alone, and you can also get targeted therapy with hormonal therapy. I'm going to go through each of those situations in terms of how we give it, what to expect, how long we give it for, and how you'll be followed. If you have early stage breast cancer, that is, it's not spread to other parts of your body, targeted therapy is given with curative intent. Studies have shown it's highly effective if your tumor is HER2 positive. Generally, we give treatment for a year, so chemotherapy might go several weeks. Targeted therapy will start while you're still getting chemotherapy and continue to complete a year. Targeted therapy is given by vein in early stage breast cancer, and there are two main drugs. There's trastuzumab and pertuzumab, and again, we give it for a year. You get it intravenously, as I mentioned, through a vein in your arm or through a semi-permanent IV called a port. I do recommend that if you're getting targeted therapy that you have a port. Having an IV placed every three weeks or so for a year can be very hard on your veins. Now, I have had people who haven't had a port, and that may be an option for you, but you probably will hear about a port. When we give you targeted therapy after chemotherapy, your hair will start to grow back in and you will be able most likely to drive yourself to and from appointments. Side effects are actually quite minimal. Some people do have side effects, but for the most part, the thing we worry about the most is damage to the heart, which can happen in some people. So we will follow your heart function using an echocardiogram or a test called a MUGA scan to make sure your heart's okay. You may also have to have additional medications to keep your heart as healthy as possible. Pertuzumab is a newer targeted therapy given to people whose tumors are HER2 positive. Pertuzumab has more side effects, in particular diarrhea. If you are receiving pertuzumab and you have diarrhea, you absolutely must let your medical team know. Don't wait until you're very sick. Some people have such severe diarrhea they can't stay on pertuzumab, but that's a decision you and your medical team will make together. It won't be all up to you to make that decision. The costs of targeted therapy are generally covered by insurance. If you have concerns about cost, however, talk with your team so you can know what the cost will be and what to expect so you can prepare. Targeted therapy in advanced breast cancer there are many more options. So in addition to pertuzumab and trastuzumab, there are many other targeted therapies that can be given. To learn more about the targeted therapies that might be available to you if you have advanced breast cancer, metastatic or stage four breast cancer, where the cells are clearly seen and identified in other parts of your body, visit yerba.com and you will see your specific targeted therapy options and how these are used and in what order. We also cover the side effects that you might expect with targeted therapy. There are many choices and new ones available all the time. If you want to learn more about targeted therapy, what treatment options might be available to you, make sure to visit yerba.com. 
If you like this video, click subscribe. It will help other people find this information.